One way to optimize voltages is to double click on compensation. Choose wells, measurement height, use negative control if using beads and there are no unstained controls. If unstained control, select the location of the well. All the parameters not in use are already deselected. Choose the wells where each single color control resides. Tubes can be used for this instead of wells if the user feels more comfortable. When finished, click OK. The selected wells will appear in the heat map view where the single controls are. The upper corner of the well has a CS on it. To open up the workspace, click on Compensation Workspace and the plot will appear. To change the run protocol, go to the Control Panel tab. To adjust the voltages, change the Setup Mode Run Protocol to the flow rate of 25 microliters per minute to avoid using all of the sample. Adjust the run protocol for recording plates. Change the volume and flow rate. Notice that the total volume must add up to the total draw volume for setup and run. Change the weight before recording, the mixing and rinsing cycles. Two choices for mixing appear. You can have standard or gentle. Click apply to group. Click Set Up Comp to start acquiring the FITSI control. To adjust the voltages, go back to the Instrument Settings tab. Click on the Voltage ribbon. You can use the sliders to adjust the voltage settings. If you drag, you must let go to refresh. You can also use the keyboard arrows or the wheel on the mouse or type in the box to change the voltages. Start with the forward scatter and side scatter. Adjust the forward scatter and side scatter gate to include the beads. Right click on the gate to apply to all controls. Adjust the fluorescent channels until the positives are on scale or not off the plot towards the right and adjust the gates. When adjustments are complete, press the stop button. Do not record until all voltages have been adjusted. Click the arrow in the control panel to advance to the next well. Repeat for CD4 APC. Then you will repeat for all remaining single color controls.
After all voltages have been optimized, click on the Experiment Explorer in BL1 or in the drop-down menu in the control panel. In the control panel, change from setup mode to record by clicking on the drop-down menu. Click record and plate will automatically switch to the next well and record the compensation controls. After the well is recorded, a check mark appears next to the sample name. After the samples are finished recording, you can go back through each sample and adjust the positive and negative gate. Compensation automatically calculates, but to view matrix, click on the compensation tab at the top and then view compensation matrix. You can view the spillover of the primary detectors into the secondary detectors. When you're finished, you can click OK.